Hello folks, and thank you for stopping by. Um, I am basically doing another microphone review, and um, I would like to thank the people at uh, Tono Direct on Amazon.com for sending this out for our review. And uh, as you can see, it's a really, really good box. Um, this particular kit comes with a whole bunch of interesting stuff, including a 48 volt power phantom power supply so we can get to get a chance to check out all that see how that works and everything so you know what let's get at it all right folks we're about to unbox this so i'm going to go ahead and start opening this up see what's inside uh, oops, I'm always borrowing things from my wife, so she's going to be probably mad at me again. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to open this box up. Mm, it's a big box, heavy. Oh, it's a little piece of tape here, I'm going to cut that off. Oh, that's alright, don't make you do that, okay. Take it off there. I'm going to open this up now. Opens up like so. Oop, there we go. All right, there we go. That's a big box. I tell you, I. Right. All right, here we go. Ooh. Okay. So, as you can see, it's got all sorts of interesting stuff here, including the manual. As you can see there, you know, very authoritative manual. So yeah, we definitely can go and be looking through that. Well, that's the that's the screen they put in front of Max to keep you basically from well spitting on the microphone. <laughs> <laughs> so this is to keep you from doing that this, this is what this is alright and uh, okay we got a USB plug yep oh so it's got one connection on one end and one connection on the other end we're definitely going to check to see how this all fits in oops that's the phantom power supply I mentioned earlier. Hmm. Interesting. All right. Oh, okay. I see what's going on here. Oh, this is the the extended arm that the microphones be resting on. Oh, okay. They did say it was gonna be, it's like a studio microphone and, well, there it is. All right. This right here, this is what you place the microphone inside of to keep it from vibrating. You know, you, when you don't want vibrations being picked up on your um, sound, you know, if you, especially if you happen to bump a table or anything. So this is what this is for. Basically, the microphone sits inside of here, and any kind of wobble or anything, the springs will absorb it first before the mic it hits the microphone. So that's good. Okay, I believe this is the part that corrects directly to the microphone itself from this end onto this plug right here. Huh? Interesting. So this would actually go, hmm, let me see, well, we'll figure out something. <laughs> we, just, we just gotta read the manual. All right. And that's the clamp for the uh, microphone stand. Of course, your windscreen, you know, keep from hearing a whole bunch of wind on your microphone, you know, when you're talking and everything, if you're outside. So that keeps the wind down. And... 
microphone itself and it is definitely well made hmm interesting Ooh, check that out see the end there so i think that's the other end of the microphone i guess it right yep that's what connects to the microphone okay all right folks now that we finished unboxing this we're actually gonna put this together and test out the sound quality all right folks i'm gonna go ahead and uh go and put this microphone together on our little desk here and see how it looks all right so we're going to start off by getting the clamp we're definitely going to need this this right here and you're gonna search your microphone all right so you put this bad boy in Now you can 
go two different ways with this. You can either uh, plug it into here. Because we understand the microphone itself, you plug it directly. Something else. There we go. That was on me right there. <laughs> Alright, so we're we in there now. Now, you could technically plug this into the, uh, the computer itself. Or, if you want the phantom power. plugs right into here and you would plug this into the uh, the microphone input on your computer or on your laptop or whatever device you want to hook this up to but it's got to be like a 5 volt supply on this end this is for the power right here so you definitely use this for the power all right and last but not least Screen so that you won't be spinning on your microphone while you're talking. <laughs> so we're gonna hook this up to here. Actually, if I do it this way, I want to do this. I'll do it this way. All right. Give me a moment, folks. <laughs> there we go. And that's how you look it up. So, in the next clip, we're going to test out the sound quality and see how this microphone kit actually works. Hello folks. Alright, we're at the part of the video where we start testing out the capabilities of this microphone. And before I start, as you probably know, the sound is not too good at the moment, but that's because the sound that you're hearing right now is coming from the camera that I'm using for this video. So I just wanted to show you the difference between the different sound qualities and the first part is coming from the camera itself and where well, the microphone in that camera is, well, 
I, I let you to be a judge of that. So, the next clip we're going to show is basically the sound quality of the microphone itself when you use. Basically, there's two ways you can plug this microphone up to your computer or a laptop or whatever other device you're using with the microphone. First way you can do it is, all right, as I showed you earlier, I showed you all the stuff that came with the microphone. All right. This plug leads to the microphone itself. And what I'm going to do is basically plug the other end, which is this. I'm going to plug this in there. And I'll plug this part right here into the microphone jack on the computer itself. So, in the next clip, you're going to actually hear what it sounds like from the microphone. Alright folks, uh, now we're at the part where we're actually trying out the microphone. As a matter of fact, what you're hearing right, the sound you're hearing right now is coming from this microphone right here. And I'm just basically checking out the levels and everything. And uh, so, to actually get a, you know, get a visual view about what we're dealing with with this microphone, we're going to go ahead and um, pop up this program called Audacity. And it's basically a free sound editing program that you can get anywhere on online just download it and you better get it uh, so got audacity on the screen here and uh, we're going to test it out testing one two three testing one two three Whee! okay that looks pretty good on here let me stop that Let's play it. All right, so now if you find that the sound quality, oh, before we can go on with that, I just want to show you something. All right, earlier I showed you the two ways to plug it up into the computer. Alright, basically, I plug this directly into here, and this plug is basically plugged up directly into the computer itself. So that's the direct connection right here. Without, you know, without the plugging up the amp. We're going to do that in the next clip. But right now, the sound you hear is coming from the microphone itself without being powered. So, but... Uh, if you feel like that, okay, this sounds a little too low, you know, you want to boost it up a little bit. What you want to do is right-click on your sound settings in your Windows um, computer. Hit recording devices. Okay, so we got the two microphone inputs on the screen here. That one on the bottom right here. Is from the camera mic that you heard earlier and well, you, well I'll leave you the side on that part <laughs> and of course this one right here is the actual mic that I have right here so if you want to boost the sound level on this basically right click on it go to properties look for levels and right now as far as the microphone itself it's at 100 so it's way up on this part but it also has another setting called microphone boost and right now that's hovering around 10 so that's good so of course if you want to boost it up I'm going to boost it up to 20 or you can boost it up to 30 you know if you really want to be real loud and everything I'm going to play it back down to 20. See how that sounds. Alright. Ooh, that looks good. Okay. Alright, let's get off here. And let's try this recording again. Testing. One, two, three. Ooh, that's interesting. Testing. One, two, three. Oh, wee! Oh, let's play that back. Test it. One, two, three. Ooh, that's it. Test it. One, two, three. Oh, wee.
test it. One, two, three. Oh, that's interesting. Test it. One, two, three. Oh, wee. Okay, well, of course that's real. The sound quality you hear is, of course, without the preamp that we haven't added on to it yet, the um, Phantom Power Supply. So, in the next clip, we're going to try out the Phantom Power Supply and see how it sounds from there. You know what? Yes, we're going to do that right now. <laughs> Alright, folks. Uh, now we have the microphone itself running through the phantom power supply that's which is right here and as you can see well as you can hear literally that the sound is well louder so playing with that so let's see how it looks on audacity let's play around on audacity a little bit here testing one two three testing one, two, three. Whee! Testing. One, two, three. Testing. One, two, three. Whee! Now remember earlier that we adjusted the sound level because we had the microphone jack to connect to the other directly into the uh, microphone jack on the f on the um, computer. So. If you want to readjust it because of it being louder because of this, basically go right back into uh, recording devices. Hello? See? That's the microphone right there. And as you can notice, that when I be talking, it, the meter goes way up. So, to adjust that, go to levels. And uh, let's take it down to 10. Yeah, let's take it down to 10. See what happens. Hello? Hello? Yeah, that sounds about right. See? It's not too loud anymore. All right, let's try it out on the Audacity Pro and see how it sounds. Testing. One, two, three. Testing. One, two, three. Wee. Testing one, two, three. Testing one, two, three. Wee. Now, as you notice, when we change the sound settings on here, for the, you know the decibel level, the, bass, the microphone boost, it got better. The sound quality got a little better. So actually a lot better <laughs> earlier I was wondering but now I know what's going on so so basically with the added phantom power supply hooked up to the microphone the sound quality is better you just got to make some adjustments for the sound to make it sound right so what I'm going to do now is Let me take it down to 10. Let's play with, let's take it down to 10. See how it really sounds. Also, as you noticed, I also backed away from the microphone because I anticipated that the, uh, the phantom power supply will boost the microphone level really loud. And so it didn't, I don't need to be close to the mic while this is going on. But, be one of those people that like to be close to the mic and everything, be able to talk and be close to the mic, so that so that your voice be captured, all the uniqueness of your voice can be captured. You basically want to make some additional adjustments, and basically I'm gonna go ahead and take this down to zero. Hello. Now see, it's low or lower. This will allow you to be closer to the mic. Hello. 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 Okay. Okay, now we're going to try this. Get rid of that. And now let's try this out. Testing. One, two, three. Testing. One, two, three. 
Here we go, here we go, here we go. And that's basically what you can do with this microphone. So, changing the decibel levels improves the quality of the sound and everything. And as far as volume, you know, you basically can change, you know, make some all sorts of adjustments with this microphone. So that that's really good. Um, so for a studio microphone, this will be great. You know. Just keep in mind that the louder and more power you put into this microphone, yes, it'll be loud. You know, you can hear everything, but if you make it too loud, that's when you start hearing noise and stuff. So just keep that in mind. Um, so that's great. And with the power, the phantom power supply, it really improved things. So. I definitely would recommend getting this microphone. It's it's really good. You know, you just gotta do some adjustments, you know, make your sound sound right and everything. You just can't just do anything, just make sure everything's right. <laughs> it is made to be a professional microphone and that it is, so So Thank you for watching and uh, I'm gonna supply the link for Amazon the Amazon shop that sells this in the description below and um, oh it's Tona Direct that's who it is Tona Direct so I'm gonna supply that link down there in the description so you can get this microphone set and um, thank you for watching subscribe to this channel and um, I, I like many likes so put as many likes on this video as you can may everyone have a blessed day